There are some animals that are biologically immortal. What this means is, although they can be killed and they can die of diseases, under the right conditions, they could potentially live forever. In the 1990s, the scientist Daniel Martinez discovered that the hydra is one animal that actually is immortal. To quote Martinez, I do believe that an individual hydra can live forever under the right circumstances. The chances of that happening are low because hydra are exposed to the normal dangers of the wild, predation, contamination, diseases. I started my original experiment wanting to prove that hydra could not have escaped aging. My own data has proven me wrong twice. As a general rule, the younger an animal starts to reproduce, the shorter its lifespan. Hydras start to reproduce when they're only two days old through the process of budding. What that means is their offspring grow out from the sides of them and eventually separate from the hydra. Typically, a species that starts to reproduce when it's just two days old would live about one month. But when Daniel, as a grad student, kept se several hydra alive in his laboratory, he noticed that they continued to live for four years. He kept each individual hydra in its own petri dish, away from things that might kill it, and fed it three times a day. He described this as a kind of paradise for hydras. Some people were skeptical of the conclusions of the original study, so Daniel then created another study, which was published in 2015, that kept more than 2,000 hydra in laboratories, and this study noticed that they lived for eight years, or twice as long as they did in the original study. Eight years is a long enough time that nearly all scientists have accepted the conclusion that hydras are in fact biologically immortal. Another interesting thing is they don't show any signs of aging, and throughout all eight years, their rate of fertility remained the same. Hydras are freshwater animals that are invertebrates, and they usually are about one centimeter in length. They have long slender bodies and several tentacles near their mouths. It seems that their immortality is due to the fact that hydras are made almost entirely of stem cells. Only a few of its cells on its tentacles and foot are fully differentiated. The fully differentiated cells are constantly being pushed off from the hydra's body and replaced. It is conceivable that there are some hydras around today that are 10,000 years old. However, in the wild, most hydras are kill killed by things like water contamination, predators, and disease, so they usually don't live this long. Scientists are looking into how knowledge about hydras can affect human longevity as well, but of course hydras are pretty different from us, being only a centimeter long and invertebrates that live in freshwater. So, not everything about hydras is directly applicable to humans. So if you like this video, go ahead and give it a like, and if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel, click the bell icon for notifications, and together we shall take over the world. I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers by December 10th at the latest, so I'd really appreciate your subscription. You can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter at ZorkMid123.